What's up, Montreal? Today I'm joined by Sam. Hi there. Who's a travel blogger from Belgium. That's right. And, well, Sam came to me by asking a question. Yeah, I wanted to know where to see the city the best, where were the best sightseeing views. Um, and yeah, I think Patrick's gonna tour me around. So yeah, so to answer uh, Sam's question, we're gonna go visit some sightseeing spots in Montreal. And yeah, let's see how that turns out. Yeah, let's go. So the first spot we're visiting is on top of the mountain. It's a pretty classic because it's Mount Royal. It's in the middle of the city. You can see the whole city. Have you been there? Uh, yeah, I've actually been there. <laughs> Earlier, you were asking me like how to get up there because like you said like it's it's pretty like it's not like you can walk up there but it's still pretty far. Well, actually, for those who don't know, you can actually come on um, Mount Royal Avenue and there's a big bus 11. It actually takes you up the mountain. Surprisingly, on um, on weekdays it passes not very often, but on okay. weekends because it's very touristic, it will pass right. like almost every half an hour and so. Yeah, on. that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, so I mean, there's three points of views that you can go on the mountain. One that's from, you can see from West Mount. The other one is facing the Olympic Stadium. But you know, we want to get the fantastic view. So we're going to the classic chalet one. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, I've been here before and it's like an amazing, every time it still takes your breath away, it's like, yeah, this is pretty much uh, Montreal. You can go on Jacques Cartier Bridge right there to see it, to get a better view uh, from that perspective. There's also um, there's also Jean Drapeau. You can go and see from the waterfront in. Okay, there are the conventional things I just mentioned where you can see the view. There's also the clock tower, but these are all very generic views of Montreal where people usually go and they see the same thing. So instead, I'm going to bring you to the Oratory on Queen Mary where. Uh, you will see a different part of the city, which is not very known, and it's still a spectacular view, so let's go. Let's go. Let's do it. Sometimes you have to be going through these torturous kind of paths to to reach the end. It's going to be a beautiful sightseeing. So it's, it's all in the works. It's worth it. I hope it's going to be worth it. Yeah. We actually made it. We are halfway up the territory. Yeah, it's been pretty intense. I mean, I've had my workout for today. Um, It's an all-in-one trip, definitely. But I mean, it was worth it because, I mean, the view is spectacular. Look at that. Look at that landscape. It's part of Montreal, which you will not see from anywhere else besides coming here. So it is definitely one place to try out. And I hope you liked it, Sam. I hope you liked your trip today. Yeah, it was amazing. I really loved the new views of the cities um, that were not downtown. So this is like a, a nice alternative. For mm -hmm. If you're sick of high buildings, you can have the low-rise view over here. It's really cool. We also did a video on Sam's channel. We That's visited right. cool coffee spots. If you want to check that out, just click on the square on the right. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And also subscribe to Sam's channel for more travel vlogs. Uh, he'll be doing around the city and of course other places that he'll be visiting. So, and that's about it. So, I'll see you next time on What's Up Montreal. Bye.